Hi, my name is Toby, and if you don't like my talk, you're, you're free to throw your rockets onto me, because I didn't get one, so. <laughs> um, I'm gonna talk about Broken Lifts, which is a project uh, which uh, was initiated by Raul uh, Krauthagen, which is uh, on the next slide, Krauthausen. And uh, he's uh, maybe well known uh, by weirmap.org, and um, yeah, there's a, a community called Sozialhelden, and uh, that's when he um, announced the topic and uh, uh, created Broken Lifts, and that uh, was in December, and uh, at the Random Hacks of Kindness event, and there were many people uh, in involved, as you can see, and um, I'm going to tell you what we did. Um, you can see that uh, that was uh, totally messed up with uh, people who didn't know each other before. And uh, we tried to create a better version of uh, out-of-service uh, notices for broken lifts here in Berlin. And the uh, current situation is that you have the S-Bahn and the uh, BVG as the public service provider. And uh, whenever a lift is broken, you can go to this website and look it up. And maybe you notice this uh, on the top. Um, S-Bahn uh, puts the current date. So I prepared that slide at 4 o'clock this night. Um, so what we came up with is this architecture, basically, uh, within 12 hours. And so we just took the information from the website, scraped it, uh, created a back-end API to uh, put out JSON and XML, and then uh, there were some guys uh, who created the front-end, um, as you could see here, maybe. <laughs> and um, so we came up with uh, two, two versions. Uh, as I said, XML and uh, JSON, we decided on JSON. And, uh, the backend could be called by different URLs, like seen here. Um, so you could ask for lifts or stations or manufacturers, whatever you like. And that was one group uh, separated, uh, developing on this. And um, so that's how it looks like. It's just a JSON file or an XML file. And there's a URL. You could just try it out if you want. And um, for the front end, we decided to uh, build a static web page uh, working with HTML, CSS, and um, JavaScript to load information. So we have a list of all the broken lifts and a detailed view. And there are some statistics because uh, we're keeping the history of uh, brokenness. And uh, that uh, allows people to view if this broken, uh, this lift is uh, broken all day, so you won't go there anymore. And uh, for convenience, you, you could uh, track a certain route. So if you uh, decide to go to Alexanderplatz and Friedrichstraße all, all week, uh, that's an URL you could use all the, all the time because it includes the IDs of the lifts. And um, so that's, that's something that uh, hasn't been on the, on the website of BVG or S-Bahn. Um, what's the next slide? I forgot. <laughs> um, yeah, we used uh, Ruby on Rails, and uh, if you're familiar with that, you could just jump in. It's uh, all on GitHub, and uh, also if you're a front-end guy or just uh, want to make design, uh, we're looking for you. And uh, you could contact us uh, via Twitter or, or just fork the GitHub project. It's all open source. You could also try and uh, uh, take a look at it and uh, just learn from it. Because I didn't know all the stuff before. I never did a project like this. And uh, we need you. We need a uh, back-end, front-end de designer. You can also spread the word. Uh, give us a tweet. And um, we want to improve the, the whole uh,
broken lift uh, situation and um, yeah if you if you uh, extend this project that would be good and yeah are there any questions please I guess there are not so that's why I put this slide in that's just uh, uh, eye candy. That's a project uh, visualization by Gauss. So that's how we created the structure of the project. And I, uh, I just put it in tonight at five o'clock because I didn't know how to fill 20 slides. And uh, that's where I finish. I'm, I'm sorry, I got to ride this one out. It's it's part of the format. Because you see, I know that there's going to be somebody who's going to watch the videos of this and then see how accurate I was at clicking and advancing every slide and seeing, come up with an error vector for each one. So yeah, five, four, three. All right, give him a round of applause. That was awesome. Thank you. Thank you.